2021, 2020, who would have known that we'd be where we are today? Hopefully the pandemic will be coming to an end, everybody's getting the vaccines and with everything else. But can you imagine right now, for the people who are invested in AMC and GME to, to understand the situation that's going on right now? I mean, think about if you really wanted to invest in the stock market, how long would it have taken you to understand the full detail, information, technology, terminology, just to start investing in money? And to really do that on a whim, to invest $100, to invest $1,000, and drop it into something and have no worries about it. I mean, that takes a lot of guts. But everything that's happening now that I think about related to AMC and GME, I, I relate back to 2008, 2009 with the housing crisis when everybody was affected in the US and even in the world. It just spread like wildfire, just like the pandemic. And watching the movie, The Big Short, and going back and learning all the terminology and understanding it, the way it was told through that movie just infuriated me even more and infuriated everybody even more. And recently, what was discovered through the hedge funds and how they're shorting GME, and now what we're seeing right now currently with AMC, it's, it's unbelievable that hopefully the tables have turned and yes, the banks, Melbourne Capital's down 49%, could be more, and even Citadel, how all these hedge funds and banks are still doing the same freaking thing, it's freaking mind blowing. But how the retail investors have held solid screwing over the banks and really holding the lines because before when things go up and up and up and up people would get excited and they sell but of course make some money but now when things dip people can panic of course they sell and they panic but now we know just hold and I, i'm just still mind blowing mind blown about all of this and i'm really so thankful to all of the youtube channels out there from trade trades to a lot of the other channels out there that are helping to dilute transfer knowledge and teach us through every day, every week, the highs and lows, what's happening and giving their opinions. Because again, this is not financial advice, it's education. And this education has gone on through Reddit, all the different subreddits from you know Wall Street Bets to the AMC stock, the GME subreddit, even the Super Stonks subreddit. People out there really sharing information and knowledge and helping each other learn about stuff. It's just been phenomenal. I mean, I don't think I could have learned this much in the past four months since November I've been growing this and I can't wait to shave this freaking thing off. So whenever this thing rockets to the moon and things settle down, I'll be shaving this off. But the amount of material that I've been able to really absorb like a sponge has been incredible. I don't think I ever could have done this before. Uh, I tried to invest years ago um, the overseas in Hong Kong, one of the brokerages over there, Charles Schwab, but they wanted $10,000 minimum to start a, 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 an account for me. I didn't have that. But now having the technology at our fingertips on our cell phones, get instant updates all the time. You know, you have Robinhood, unfortunately, but yes, people do use that. Fidelity, Charles Schwab, We Trade, We Bull. All these little apps that are, that are there that link us to invest ourselves, invest time. Um, and it, of course, it's a huge learning curve, but it has given, I think, the retail investor, the common people, moms, dads, kids, teenagers who are just turning 18, Everybody, I've seen so many people who have invested their <laughs> everything, part of their life into this, and they're willing to do it because of what they believe in. And for me, done the same thing. I've thrown everything I can at this to really build upon my future and also for the future of, of uh, everything below me and the people around me too, so they can have a better future, but also to know that, you know, I have an opportunity to improve my life and also I do take risks through crypto cryptocurrency, but knowing that I don't have to keep my money in just a bank account and I'll learn that earn that little deposit fee and have the banks take more money out. I don't have to do that anymore. We don't have to live that life. And I'm so thankful again to all of you out there educating us through the terminology, the DD reports, that's the due diligence and putting their time and effort into explaining things like us five or explain E-L-I-A, -E explaining like I was an ape, part of the community. So to all of you out there, thanks a lot, appreciate it. Stay strong, hold the line because things will be coming to an end for them. And hopefully for us, to the moon. So, thanks for watching. Hopefully, That'll be us soon, celebrating 